hello guys uh, welcome to uh, this video and uh, in this video i will talk about uh, if you are using adobe premiere pro then you might have noticed that uh, your uh, hard drive is getting full okay okay uh, for no reason at all so um actually it took me actually a lot of research to find out what was the issue when i was actually when i was facing facing that issue so uh, what i find out is if you go to if you open your premiere pro software and if you go to edit and if you go to preferences and uh, you have to go to um, it says uh, media cache okay so when you go here and then you will see the address here okay media cache files okay so uh, uh, see uh, users and your username app data roaming adobe and common so you have to go to that folder manually just to make sure that you delete actually everything because uh, only do that once you actually finish with your project okay if you are working within uh, premiere pro otherwise uh, it is gonna render again your uh, video files and you know all those render files actually uh, are taking your uh, space okay your hard drive space so what we have to do we have to go to uh, run okay once you go to run and then you have to type uh, this address okay uh, what you can do just type uh, C um, okay then you have to type uh, users okay sorry i have to do the slash to together but other way around and then i have to type users okay and uh, just copy the address uh, your uh, your your username and then uh, app data app data uh, won't come up because it is an invisible folder and then you have to type again then you have to type a uh, um, uh, roaming okay roaming and then adobe adobe and then common okay c o double m what you have to do you have to press enter by this point and then it will open up this folder and then what you can do uh, you can just go back uh, don't go back just go to the folder and go to media cache files okay so these are the files actually which are taking a lot of space as you can see is 133 mb which is not a lot but because uh, i haven't done much in premiere pro recently but if you are using a uh, premiere pro quite heavily then you have to actually uh, what you can do you can just go back and then right click and then create a shortcut folder into your desktop okay so by doing this um, you will be actually is easy for you to access you don't have to go back to premiere pro to or you know each time to copy this address and then what you can do by this point go to media cache files select all hold shift and hit delete okay so by this point you can just uh, click yes and then everything is disappears so uh, you know uh, by this way you can actually clear up a lot of space okay from your hard drive and uh, apart from that you can also actually delete un unused and okay and it is gone okay um you can just click browse as well you might be thinking oh i can click browse and then just go to that folder but it, for me it won't work when i click that it will take me to a computer you know the computer directory not the uh, actual this address here because app data room app data is i think invisible that's why maybe is hidden actually so uh, you might try this one it might work for you but uh, i this is what i do i just create a shortcut folder and i delete my files there what i once i am done with the project okay so this was a very short video i hope um, it was helpful if it does please uh, hit the like button and subscribe for more and i will see you in the next video take care